Hi, it's Mariga here from Skin Essentials and thank you for once again tuning into one of my FAQ skincare series. So today the question is, um, how do I still get a tan if I am wearing sunscreen? So the questioner is, is wondering how that happened. And I do also get this question the other way around, which is if I wear sunscreen, can I still get some tan? So um, the answer to the second first is yes, you actually will find, depending on your own uh, skin chemistry and the amount of melanin present in your own skin, you, you can st still find that you will um, darken in skin color throughout the summer, even if you are very good at wearing your SPF, and I will explain that to you now. So there are a few ways, I won't go into them all here, but there are a few ways that the skin um, responds to sunny weather in order to make melanin and um, thus darken the skin but the two important ways and specific to this question about you know if you're wearing SPF and everything so two things to know about that the first is that you know your body is so sophisticated it is trying to protect you all of the time with all of these processes going on that we you know thankfully aren't even aware of or we'd be exhausted thinking about it but one of the first is that when there is more UV as there is now in the summer at least here in Ireland um, at this time of the year the UV rays you know, are absorbed by the eyes, they go through the retina, that signals um, the pituitary gland to start producing melanin stimulating hormone. Um, it tells your body, it's one way that your body has of reacting to its environment. So it tells the body, it's sunny, it's consistently sunny, um, let's make more melanin to protect, because that's what melanin is for, each little granule um, is released and it's captured by a skin cell, by um, a keratinocyte, and it's used like an umbrella over the nucleus of the skin cell to protect it from, from burning and from damage. So that's the first way. So even if you are wearing your SPF, then obviously, yes, this um, reaction is triggered through the eyes. And the question then that always follows on from that is, well, what about you know wearing good UV protection sunglasses? No, there is no way to wear sunglasses that will filter all UV or obviously they would be entirely opaque and you wouldn't see. So this process will always happen. So that is one reason why you can still tan even though you're being good with your sunscreen. Um, and that is what I would call a safe tan. That is your body's normal reaction to the environment that is how it protects itself and that is entirely safe so that process is not having any adverse effect on the health or on the aging it's not accelerating aging on your skin the way burning would so the second way that your body one of the, the second of many ways that your body produces melanin is so direct heat so again so you are good with your spf it's all over your body but there's a lot of heat um, this is particularly, you know, when you're driving the car and this, well, depending where you are in the world, um, for us, it's the right hand side. You know, you will feel that real extreme heat um, on your arm, on your hand, on that side. Um, so that heat triggers uh, production of uh, melanosomes as well to protect. So even though you haven't burned because you've got your SPF on, the very presence of that consistent heat is telling your um, body to make more um, pigment to protect yourself so that is why you can still darken it in skin tone over the course of the summer depending on as I said your own skin like I could be as exposed to heat or UV all I like I'm never going to tan this is why somebody like me would burn and then peel and then go back to white again um, so burning and tanning are not the same thing they're two different um, processes within your body. So I hope that helps to explain that to you. Um, you will, and this is, you know, also if, if you've got younger people or if you are one of the younger people or got younger people in your life who like to tan, you know, maybe share this with them, explain to them that they can still get some color, but in a safe way while also using SPF. So um, yeah, that's everything I wanted to say about that for today. So thanks so much for listening. Please do leave any comments below and I will come back to you. If you've got any questions, any feedback, I love to hear from you. And do please share this with anybody who may find it useful. Thank you so much for listening and I'll talk to you next time.